Hey, 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 how's it going again, Guardians? LV Native coming at you with another Destiny 2 video. Well, you know what time it is. It's Friday. That means Zur is back in town. He's located in the tower over in this back corner, back over where Dead Orbit is. Let's go ahead and see what he's brought for us today. Faded Engram, you guys should know the story by now. Use this only if there's a couple exotics left that you need to get. Otherwise, I just think it's way too pricey for it, all right? For the weapon, we have got the Darcy Sniper Rifle. So real quick, we'll take a look at this. The Intrinsic per Personal Assistance. Aim at an enemy to view its health and other critical information in the scope. Extended Barrel, Extended Mag, Target Acquired Trait. When Personal Assistant is active, this weapon has better target acquisition and deals more precision damage. So, kind of a fun sniper rifle to use. Really nice for you to get an idea of the distance between you and your targets. Really helps when you're number crunching, figuring out what's best for min-max builds. So, really, overall, it's an okay sniper rifle, but not one to write home about. Next up, we got the Dragon Shadow Chest Armor. This is going to be for all the hunters out there. The intrinsic perk here is the Wraith Metal Mail. Grants increased movement and weapon handling speed for a short time after dodging. Very, very cool if you like to do a very dodge-centered uh, build. Otherwise, it's a little bit too... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? It's a little bit too niche for my taste. Um, Nezrik Sin Helmet for the Warlocks out there. We got the Abyssal Extractor's Intrinsic Perk. Void damage kills increase ability energy recharge rates. So, again, pretty kind of cool, but very, very specific to a certain type of play style. If that's you, though, this really might be a very nice fit for you. And last but least, we have got the MK44 stand asides for the Titans with the intrinsic perk of seriously, watch out. Grants an overshield when sprinting at full health with seismic strike, hammer strike, or shield bash equipped. Hits with these abilities recharge a portion of your melee energy. So this can be a very, very fun, you know, uh, play style. You can do entire builds around this one particular piece of equipment. So again, kind of cool if you guys don't have it and you want to, go ahead and pick it up for 23 legendary marks. All right, guys, so that's going to wrap it up for this one. Just a real quick, fast video. I got things I got to go do today, but I want to make sure I got this information out for you guys. In the comments below, let me know if you guys are picking any of these up or let me know what you're hoping he brings next time, all right? But as always, Guardians, this is LV Native. You guys are awesome, and I will see you in the next one.